My side crooked and crooked the other side. Today is now Tuesday, six in the morning, well seven now. And as you can see, I'm in Zakaa. We're on the road. We pretty much just started at like 6.30. Just started our trip. And we already are making a stop. My mom is gonna have a stop and ain't she. But yeah, it's moving day. I'm actually excited. I actually have energy because I went to bed kind of late last night just finalizing like putting stuff together and stuff like that so i went to bed at around 12 ish and woke up at like 4 35 ish y'all i'm up though just had some waffles and then also a smoothie bowl so i should be good until like 11 we'll probably be getting lunch at 11. look at her look at some other <laughs> Say good morning to the vlog. Hold on, let me let me back up. Oop, that's zooming in. Let me make good up. morning vlog. The roadies, roadies. We on our way, Memphis. Memphis. Memphis Part three Mom over here. Wait. Part five. Part four. Part four of the road trip, but part. Oh. Part two for me going to school. Right. Sophomore year. She's a sophomore. Oh, you need to get something to eat though, because you haven't eaten anything, have you? It's seven o'clock. I've never. I don't eat at seven o'clock. Well, you need to eat at seven o'clock. I'm actually about to get into some editing, and I'm gonna have a video uploaded today. <laughs> We made it to Memphis and I'm actually already moved in. I got everything into my room now and it's around, is it six already? It just turned seven and we got here at around 2.30ish and we started moving in from that point and we finished around four, like 4.25 or something like that. We went to American Deli, got something to eat there and I stopped at Dollar Tree and Family Dollar to pick up a couple toiletry items and cleaning products. I am wore out. I just ate a cupcake. My friend, which is also my roommate, she got me some cupcakes from her job. So I was already smashing it. But it was really good. I'm gonna save some for later. <laughs> save the little two bites for later. I'm ready to just get moved in, get everything settled in and be done with it because it's always hectic. It was really hot. It was extremely hot today, like extreme. Like it wasn't just heat. It was, ooh, it was a whole, the whole nine, like humidity, people. I actually feel like, I don't know, the vibe feels good. I feel good, ready to get moved in. I actually like decorating, so I can't wait to start decorating and stuff like that. So here is the before. I'm gonna show y'all the before. I'm not gonna show y'all the process of me doing it all, like, cause I wanna get it done. So here is the before of my room, as y'all see. I know it seems like it's a lot, but it's really not. Again, the main thing I packed was clothes. So those are kind of packed in there. I had to file some room flaws, cause like this right here, it's like, it's being weighed down by the clothes. But if y'all can see, like the little thing is not attached. And that's not supposed to be like that. I don't know, whoever had this side of the room before it was really tearing stuff up. Cause it's like the carpet. I put that all in the little order, the little orange paper that they give us to write down everything in. We're gonna get started on this room. About to take me a shower though, because I was sweating. Sweating like I've never sweat before, like literally.
saying hasta la vista hasta luego to my mama new journey sophomore big sophomore <laughs> big sophomore, sophomore in college yeah. oh Good afternoon, it's day two of moving and we just got from the grocery store and like Family Dollar and all that just to pick up a last few items. The last few items that I didn't pick up yesterday, I didn't make a list so I forgot a lot of stuff yesterday but got everything I needed today. Here's the progress on my room. It's not a lot left, got the bed together pretty much. Drawers are full. Just setting up like all my desk stuff that's what's in here and uh, yeah really I just need to get the desks together and then I'll be finished not a lot to do the closet came out really good still working on that and then I'm actually moving my fridge because it's on Janae's side and I'm not keeping it over there of course but I needed to figure out where I was gonna put it so don't be making no faces <laughs> So I'm gonna actually move this little drawer right here and move the fridge under there cause it'll fit. And then I think I'm also gonna go ahead and put my microwave under there as well. It's another extremely scorching day outside. Very. So I got a lot of things put together and put in place now. And I'm actually about to take a break and eat pretty soon because all I've had are, all I had was a granola bar after we got from the grocery store and it's about to be three. Actually, it's already three. And y'all, y'all remember the packages I was talking to y'all about that got sent to the school at the beginning of the summer when it was supposed to go to my house? I went and picked them up today. So let's go ahead and open them and see what they're talking about because it better not disappoint after being sent to the wrong place. I remember what I got. It was a hat, a sunglass holder, and I think some jewelry as well. Looks like the same. Super cute hat. Fit, better fit. Ooh, this is gonna be good storage or something. I'm keep this. Always keep these bags, y'all. I can pack so much. I'm gonna put the jewelry in there. See this cute little male boy hat? It's cute. Jean. Pelum. Whatever it's called. Pelum. Peplum hat? No, it's not Peplum. Super cute patchwork hat. Let's see what it looks like. Ooh. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's gonna fit today. Ah, it's a little snug, but maybe it's supposed to fit like that because it's not supposed to be like directly on the head. That's cute. Mm. That's cute. I don't think it's supposed to be directly on the head, but. Yeah. Okay. Uh oh, it look a little weird from the side, but it just needs to get back shaped right. But yeah, that's cute. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Super cute. I have an idea of what I can style this with. Ooh. I'm gonna keep that in there. That's a super cute hat. Super cute. Ooh, I'm so glad that this room is looking a lot better now. Jeez. Oh, let's see. Let's the jewelry. Yep. This, these are the rings. Ooh, I can't wait to wear these. I was so excited for these. So excited. Ooh, yes. What's it saying there? Thank you. Your order made us do a happy dance. Thank you for being an amazing customer and having fantastic taste. With love from Delta Delphia. Billy. Okay, and here's the sunglass holder. Oh, and the pins. Oh, I don't even need these now. I don't need them now. That's so many pins. This is a convenient of a convenient container to have them in though. So that'll come in handy. Handy dandy. Oh, I can't wait to be done. I can't wait to be done with this. I am so ready to just sit down and be moved in. Mm -mm -mm. 
also put my calendar up too and decorated it with a little with a little tiger theme. Just something quick. Okay. So they just hook on there. That's cute. That's not too big. That's how it's looking. That's my mama. My mama. You made it home? Yeah. Woo. I'm in Airpods. Thank you. Waiting for my Uber. Okay. Nice, nice. Yeah. Whew. I know that you was, feel good. Um, huh? I know you feel good. Yeah. Love you. All right. Love you too, baby. So, up under here, I put my fridge. And like I have my shower basket. And then I also put my microwave and some snacks over there. A snack basket. And yeah, it's expensive being a human being. It's coming out really cute. Like I love what I'm doing with my space. I don't know if these rooms are bigger. I think I was telling you all about this, but the ceilings are higher than in the dorm I was in last year. Cause these are suites, but I thought the room would be bigger, but I don't think it is. I think it's the same size, just higher ceilings, which makes it feel like the room's bigger. I think I'm gonna go head out and do something because they're having a lot of events today. But we'll see because I'm not really feeling it. I'm cramping. Ooh. I'm gonna see what's going to be going on and Good if I want to participate in it. As y'all can tell, it's the next day. Well, I don't know if I can tell, but it's the next day. And I'm ready to head out onto the campus. They're having a block party. It just started at like 1.30 and it's 1.40 something right now. So me and Janae are about to head there. Hopefully they have some food. I did grab me some snacks yesterday. We went to the movie night just to grab some snacks and have our own movie night. But Janae didn't grab me any snacks, like a fake friend. Like, um, what's up with that? She didn't tell me to grab her those snacks. Yes, last, I did. You told me last minute, thank you very much. You should have stood up when I stood up. Girl, no, I was doing something. Mm -mm. But I got what I could grab. I had to get the scraps. But I mean. <laughs> you was the first person in the world. <laughs> she lying. And then we fell asleep. She was knocked out and I was knocked out. I don't even remember falling asleep. But it's about to, it's like 100 degrees outside right now. And it really does feel like it. So we got our hot girl summer outfits on. <laughs> And my room is almost pretty much done. It probably is more on the done side than on not the done side. I just need to hang up my pictures. So I'm going to head to Family Dollar after that and get the last little knickknacks and patty wax. Nice. I gotta have the. You gotta. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> You got your pen on? Yeah. Okay, here. <laughs> Can you hold it real quick? Hold Actually, we can. Y'all, we got some little baggies. A little goodie bag. This bullshit. We went inside to chill a little bit because she couldn't take the heat. She couldn't handle the Memphis heat. I could. I was just sweating a little bit too much. <laughs> and I don't like sweating. But I'm thinking about doing some interviews. I don't know if I want to do them right now. Mm -hmm. We'll see. You should. We'll see. I think you should. Y'all see, she's trying to mess with the <laughs> <laughs> Bro, why do we think of the same thing? Let me show them the pit. I mean, no, they have the hair. They have to see the details. Put your hair right here. How you turn it? How you turn it? Uh, yeah. Y'all see the deets? Look at the manicure. Look at the deets. Hold on. <laughs> Y'all. Look at her fingernails. <laughs> The deets of the bracelet is focus. Hold on, wait. Don't press it. There. Yeah. I bought her that, by the way. Mm. And then, wait, <laughs> wait, shut on the other hand. Because I didn't really see this one. This one. Yum. Okay. This is my Janae's channel. It's getting cut. <laughs> 
Okay, so I'm here with Got dreads, he does. It. And what's a positive stereotype about you? Man, you already know how it is. Man. You come down here, you gonna always have a good time. Okay. What's the first thing you think about when you create an outfit? Uh, I think about the colors. Okay. So you try to do like a monochromatic type of style. Yeah. Okay. And how would you describe your style? Laid back. Do you ever try to like branch out of your norm or anything like that? Or do you try to keep it safe sometimes? Like casual work okay. is one of the times I branch out. Okay. And what's your favorite thing about fashion? Sure. Yeah, you see what I got on? <laughs> you see what I got on? You freeze. Alright, well that's all I have for you today. Thank you for answering my questions. We spotted another fashion today. I'm here with... I'm with the thing. Alright, so it's from like a lot of different places. My hat's from Lynn, my shirt's from my brand, uh, Orphic, Bag, Amazon, Short, I don't even know. <laughs> yeah! Okay. Uh, my Amazon, I think my friend gave me this. Okay. Not, you know, not too much. Oh, nice. Nice. Yeah, go check out the website. Yeah. And where are you from? I'm up in Baltimore, Maryland. Okay, cool. And what's a stereotype about your city that is popular? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're very creative. Like, it's a lot of creative here. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of talent there. You know, not just talking about Obviously, myself. Obviously, it created you. Thank mm -hmm. you. <laughs> Hey fashionistas, good afternoon. Today is now Friday. It's around, well it's 1.10 right now and I'm dressed to go ahead and head out for the day. They have a couple events going on. They have an involvement fair at 1.30 and Frost Frenzy. And that's the thing where like they have, they have food trucks, give you tickets so you can get the food for free pretty much with the tickets. Um, and then they do a performance from the brand, from the bands. <laughs> and yeah we just all gather around i don't know if that's just for freshmen though so i need to check and see if it is but yeah that's what the plans are for today i have a couple things to do i'm gonna apply my nails today and paint my toes and um i need to print my schedule out as well just so i can have it and see it all the time um what else i went to the gym this morning and it was a really good workout I love going to the gym, y'all. I need to finish editing my video that I have posted either today or tomorrow. It might be tomorrow because, you know, I don't want to get involved on campus right now. I'm going to hang my mirror up along with the pictures as well on my wall because it's looking real blank and looking real scary <laughs> right now. It's going to be another hot day. It's already hot. It was hot at freaking nine in the morning it was already 94 degrees like what is going on but i love the heat i love the sun i love my summer skin y'all i got the butters going the butters is buttering mm. 
Y'all saw the Frost Frenzy though last year when I went to it. But we'll see what's going on because I don't know if I'm going to that just quite yet. I ended up going later last night. I went to the UC takeover that they were having. And when I went up there, I went right back out. <laughs> it was just so many people. Like it looked fun and all. But I just think I was already overstimulated for today, for the day. And just wanted to get in bed. So I made me some Alfredo, some chicken Alfredo last night, y'all. Mmm. Y'all know I was chefing it up last year. I am chefing it up again. Chefing it up again. The only thing I didn't have in the Alfredo were vegetables. I did buy some, but it's in a can. And I don't have a can opener after I got back to my dorm. I was like, okay. So it was just chicken and noodles, but it was really good with the sauce. Bro, you can do that another time. I look good on it. I, a quick introduction, my name is Tyler. And I'm a communications major, uh, concentration in film meter, and I'm with this thing to discuss uh, my movie because she's gonna design the clothes. She's gonna tell me what clothes to wear for the film and stuff like that. And, uh, that's all. Yeah. Do you listen to Beethoven? Do you listen to Beethoven? Not casually. No. <laughs> Not casually, I've heard him. Alright, I'm back in my room right now and I'm just gonna do a few things on my to-do list while I'm in here. I got my class schedule printed and I didn't end up going to any of the buildings just quite yet. I'll probably just do that tomorrow because this is really hot. It's going to be hot tomorrow too, but I'm just tired of being outside for right now. Moving in update. I'm about to show you all the room because it's, it's done, I would say. But I'm going to go ahead and put this mirror up and then also the pictures up as well. Well, she say she get it from her mama. I'm gonna you. Get right. I'm gonna play. Good. You can touch my bag. Wish you could. I don't know the dance, y'all. I know it's bad. Abs. Ooh, look at it. I know y'all see that. Oh my mama. Hey. Oh my mama. Oh my. Oh my. are up I'm gonna be adding more to the wall because it's still pretty blank to me and yeah I have an idea of what I want to do I'm probably gonna add some gold roses like a string of gold roses kind of going around that would be really cute today's now Saturday and it's 12 well it's 102 right now and I'm about to head to the grocery store again because I need to get some food for the next few days while I'm here I'm not trying to spend too, too much on food right now, but I'm going to go ahead and grab some things that'll last me at least a week or so. And I got my big bag with me. Got my big bag because I'm taking the bus, so I need a bag so I can carry all my groceries on my way back. So that's what I'm doing. And yeah, I'm about to go ahead out right now. I was thinking about going to the pool today, but I think I'm going to do that tomorrow since there's a few things going on today. There's a talent show from 7 to 9, so I think I'm going to go see that. <sighs> Y'all, whoo, whoo, sheesh, let's turn that down. I just came back from the grocery store. Whew. I did take my big bag with me so I could carry my groceries easier, even though it was still a hassle. It's hot. It's real hot out there. But the weirdest stuff is happening today. So 
I had first went to Dollar Tree, right? Just to grab some snacks, little dollar snacks, whatnot. I get in the line. I'm standing there for a few minutes. There's a couple people in the line. Like, it's a lot of people in there right now. I'm standing there, and an older guy walks in front of me and gets behind the person I'm behind. And at first, it looked like he was looking at the little side items because you know how aisles had the side items, right? So I thought he was looking at that because he was turned twisted that way. So I'm like, okay, he's probably just looking before I'm like, hey, I'm in line. So I'm like, I'm standing there for a couple more seconds. Seconds. And I'm like, okay, it seems like he's just standing there. I was like, let me say something. I'm like, excuse me, I'm in line. And he was like, you wasn't in line when I walked up. I was like, yeah, I was. <laughs> I was like, I've been standing here the entire time. He was like, when I walked up, I saw this guy right here. Mind you, I'm standing literally, there's a box right where I'm standing at. So when he, I'm standing right here, this is the box. This is the guy that's in front of me. This is him walking up. Now, he was older. So you mean to tell me you didn't see me out of your peripheral? You didn't see nobody standing here. And the guy, the guy that I was behind looks back and says nothing. And it's not his obligation to, but it's still the fact of the matter that you knew I was standing here. You know I was standing here too. I was going to be like, didn't you see me? Wasn't I standing here the entire time? I didn't even feel like doing all that. I was like, okay, you're about to be weird. And I didn't have my taser on me, so I couldn't even, I kept my cool at the moment. Because I, I was just like, it just, it don't even matter. I just went into the next line because the lady was finished bringing out some people. But it's like, really, dude, you're going to sit here and argue about me for standing here? Why would I sit here and lie about me standing right there? And then, as I'm walking into Kroger, I hear some guy say she could get hit too. And it's like, I look over and they're staring at me and I keep staring at them for a minute because I was like, I know y'all wasn't just talking about me. What, like, why would you even say some weird shit like that? So, I'm getting my cart and I look over and they still staring and I'm, I'm standing there staring at them like, and I take my glasses off and I'm like, do I know you? And he was like, you have nice legs. What? I was just like, because I had to keep my cool. Because one, I didn't have my taser on me, so I wasn't about to go off. I'm in a different city for two, so it's like I'm really going to stay cool right now. It's just like, moments like this really show me how unprotected, first of all, women are. And black women, specifically. To a whole nother degree, we are unprotected on a whole nother level. And it's days like this where it really just hits me. It's like, damn, like really nobody be having our back for real. Sometimes we as a community don't even have our backs for each other. It was just weird. It was weird shit having the back to back. I'm like, what's going on? I just wanted to get up. I just wanted to grab some groceries. I just wanted to grab some groceries. And it was just bombarding like all both of those events happened back to back so it was like really what is going on what is going on it's it's so uncomfortable like what is wrong with men in america most likely men all around the world but i know it seems like i'm like really just screaming right now but it was just um it's just too much going on i'm already on my cycle it's hot as hell outside literally i'm by myself i'm a woman and I'm getting my groceries in broad daylight. Like, it just be weird stuff like that. Karma always gonna get people. That's why it's like sometimes having a reaction to everything, not everything deserves a reaction because the universe is gonna take care of that. I'm like, we're in Dollar Tree, bro. But it's like, I'm sitting here with a whole ass cart. You didn't see me and this big ass cart in front of me. You didn't see either. I don't know if that's a sign that I just need to stay inside for today because I need nothing more weird going on. I really want to keep my energy, really want to keep my peace. I'm going to go ahead and apply these nails and that'll pretty much be, here. here's what they look like by the way. Really cute, something basic but like something a little bit with a little design on it but not too much just like a subtle design i really thought these were cute it's giving like fairy nails so i'm gonna go ahead and apply those and that'll be pretty much the rest of my maintenance for back to school right now it's 5 47 i just got out of the shower not too long ago so i'm probably still gonna head to the talent show at around seven 
but we'll see if I even feel like it because today has been a tumultuous day. Goodness gracious. Usually when I apply nails, like I just be putting them on without like filing. Some people file down their nails, I guess to make it attach better, but I don't do that because I don't want to damage like the top of my nails. I don't know. But we're gonna try and do it the right way. Second every minute, man, I swear that she can get it. Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high, hands up high, hands up high. Tell them dim the lights down right now. Put me in the mood. I'm Ooh, I love how these came out. I love the style of these. They don't even give press on for real. Yes. So I'm about to go ahead. I have a video that I uploaded at 12 today. I'm gonna go ahead and add some tags to those. Tune in to that video. It's my wash day. And it's 623 right now, so I have some time until the talent show starts. I'm probably just gonna throw on some comfortable shorts, probably some jorts. I've been loving jorts. My camera's about to die, so I'm kind of talking fast. But yeah, I'm gonna head there and then I'll vlog a little bit of that for y'all and that'll wrap up my first week moving video Dedicated to the fun sex, your natural hair and your soft skin and your big ass and that sundress. Ooh. 